Yes, Marissa. Now in last night's election, Alpena County voters decided to recall Councilman David Karshnick and Councilman Michael Nunley. Now Councilman Karshnick was recalled with 55.62% of the vote being yes with 2,474 votes and 44.3% voted no with 1,974 votes. Now, Councilman Nunley was also recalled with 53.88% of the vote being yes, with 2,389 votes and 46.12% of the vote being no, with 2,045 votes. Now, Alpena County voters decided to keep Mayor Matt Walgore in office with 2,459 votes against his recall and 44.73% of the vote to take him out of office. Now we spoke with Wal Gora earlier today to get his thoughts about the outcome of the recall and the city, the next steps the city has to take to fill those two positions. And I, I believe more in the uh, in the election process than I do in the recall process. So it uh, it's not um, to see to see someone that's uh, that's served as long as they have and someone is committed to the community go. Uh, it, it's unfortunate, but like I said, at the same time, it's uh, it's a um, uh, Time to move on from this entire thing and, and uh, go to the next step. We also spoke to Cindy Johnson of the pro recall effort as well. Johnson says her group is pleased with the outcome as the goal was to give Alpena a voice. She says Alpena clearly got one. Now since the remaining council members need to appoint two temporary councilmen to serve until the special, special election in Febu February, we asked Johnson, is her group has anyone that will be stepping up to the plate? Johnson says without releasing the names, she knows of two people who have applied with the city to be considered to fill those temporary spots. Now the council has 30 days to fill those temporary spots and the special election will cost the city over close to $10,000. Live from City Hall for WBKB News, I'm Marlena Hamilton.